and this is a nice barra. This is the new classic 120 suspending. They've just brought this lure out. It goes down to about 10 feet on the cast and uh, it's been working here today. Just give it a couple of zaps, jig jig, wind, jig jig, wind and it stays at that depth and the fish seem to be down at that depth, about three meters, 10 feet. So that's the classic 120, that's the new suspending version. A really nice barra. George is on. What's he hooked on, mate? Uh, classic barra. In the 12 plus. In you go, mate. Just go around the other side and show you how you nip the fish. Okay. Swim with his head, pull his head into the net. Pull his head into the net, that's it. Right, okay. There we go. Beautiful. Hang on, just lift some slack off. Well done, mate. Oh, shit. There we go. Yeah, nice fish. What happened? You didn't know he had him on? Tell us I again. I didn't even know he had him on. I was winding, and then I seen this thing. What, what is that, a shark? Come down the back. Come here, come here with that net quick. Yeah, baby! The old classic barra. Look at that, straight down his gob, mate. He's inhaled it! I didn't even know I was on. I can't believe that. I thought it was just free jumping. As I said, is that mine? Oh, talk about... I can't believe how fish that big can hit your lure and not know about it. Look at that, the lure's completely gone. He's just inhaled, that's what, a 15 centimetre, and he's just demolished that. As George said, that classic 120, 10 plus, is right down the gullet of this beautiful barra. Great fish. And you can see how the line is chafed from the, uh, the sides of that fish's mouth. So what uh, Steve Sarab is doing here, George's nice barra that he just caught, we showed you that, lured down its gob, and we want to do some more, we want to measure it. George wants to get a photo for his camera. What we recommend you do is give a good fish like this a bit of a swim, uh, in between all the, nice, all the things you want to do, like measuring it, photographing it, perhaps weighing it in the net, different cameras. Um, it just makes sense really, it gives them the opportunity to breathe, to get their strength back. And uh, when you finally release it, as you'll see, it'll just swim away and you can be guaranteed that it will survive. Congratulations, mate. <laughs> Excellent. That fish has been in the water. Probably three minutes, maybe more. I should spin him around. Oh, it doesn't matter. It's just over 80, 83, is it? 83. I would have called it for a 90 yeah, myself. It's 90. very well conditioned. All right, George is just going to put this fish back. Look how its dorsal's up high. That means it's in good nick. And uh, we're going to let him go straight away. Give him a bit of a shove. Oh. Off he goes. Well done, guys. And that's how you do it. <laughs>